Vibrant markers and bouncy brush pens are great for adding a dash of personality to your journal or planner. In this video, we'll go over some of our favorite markers and brush pens for journaling, plus ideas on how to use them. Let's get started. If you usually use your journal for diary entries, check out these colorful recommendations. The convenient Zebra ClickArt sign pens are a handy way to add color to your journal, even when you're out and about. The retractable design means you won't have to deal with lost caps, while a ridge on the side of the barrel keeps the pen from rolling away. The 36 colors are available individually or in sets. Color coding is an attractive way to keep your journal organized. You can write about different topics, make wish lists, copy down quotes, and more, all on the same page. Besides, who doesn't love journal spreads packed with color? If you're already a fan of the Marvie Le Pen, you'll definitely want to pick up some of these Flex brush pens. They come in 18 colors, 14 of which match the Le Pen lineup, so you can coordinate your color combinations. They use the same quick drying smear resistant ink as the markers, but with a versatile brush tip. We especially like using the Le Pen Flex for brush calligraphy headers. They are easy to use, even for beginners and produce beautiful line variation without taking up too much space. Make sure your habits stick by recording your progress in a journal. These markers will help keep your journal organized. Sakura Pegma Micron pens are beloved by artists for their variety of tip sizes and archival quality ink. They're an excellent option for journalers too. We like to use a couple of different tip sizes in our journal to keep pages neat. For example, the 0.2 millimeter tip works well for drawing boxes and dividers, while a bolder 0.4 millimeter tip is good for general writing. The ink also resists smudging under markers and highlighters. Your writing will last, even if you spell coffee or water on your notebook. We just had to recommend these Kuretake Zig double-sided dot markers. They have hard plastic tips on one end that draw crisp lines and stay precise. The squishy dot tips on the other end can be used like brushes, creating charming strokes depending on how much pressure you apply. We love using these markers in our habit trackers. Make the dots smaller or larger to show goals that can be partially achieved, like minutes of exercise. When you review your trackers later, you can easily see how well you did. An art journal lets you convey your thoughts in a creative way. Brush markers are convenient and expressive, which makes them perfect for art journaling. Is it any surprise that Tombow Dual Brush Pens are a tried and true journaling favorite? These double-sided brush pens come in over 100 colors. You can create a custom palette or pick up a coordinating set. This brush pen is fantastic for both art and brush lettering. You can make thin and thick strokes with the brush tip then add precise details with the bullet tip. The water-based ink blends with a colorless blender or water, so you can create smooth gradients with ease. Faber-Castell Pitt Artist Pens ensure that the art you create in your journal will stand the test of time. The markers are filled with richly pigmented India inks that are vibrant and permanent. There are also tons of tip sizes and options to choose from. Pit Artist Pens can be blended while wet and layered like watercolors. To give your art journal a unique look, try using them on toned paper. The vibrant inks pop on the page while letting the tones of the paper come through. Which of these markers or brush pens would you use in your journal? Let us know in the comments below. You can find all of these products and more at jetpens.com. Thanks for watching.